I don't give a fuck about that. I'm used to use them shits as fucking toys and shit. They can see a crack bottle and be like, I'm gonna make my vow hit your vow. He <laughs> don't fuck about no crack or none of that stupid shit. We enjoyed ourselves. That's why I tell people, live your life and fucking enjoy your age. If you're in your 40s, if you're in your late 30s, if you're in your 50s, however you feel is how you are. Fuck that. I love being from the 1900s. The only time, the only time I don't like being from the 1900s is when an app asks me for my date of birth. <laughs> That's the worst fucking thing in the world. When you think that. <laughs> you don't realize how old you are until you, you find the month and the day and then you gotta get to the year, and you just be sitting there. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and then you stop that shit, because you thought, you think you got there, you stop it. Oh, you know, I got, gotta be here. You look, that shit said 2002, you be like, fuck. It's a long way to the 1900s. <laughs> you know when you get old, man. You know, when you get old, your shit start occurring. You know, when you get no young people walk past your house and they just piss you off. They ain't been shit to you or nothing. They ain't disrespect you or nothing. They just walk past your house. And you just look at them. Look at these stupid ass dudes. Look at them. Look at these niggas up to your good, you know. And this is going to school. You just jealous of that fucking youth. That's all that is. You know when you get no when you drive in your car for an hour. And don't listen to no fucking music. But it's just you and your thoughts. <laughs> when you start really concentrating on how to drive, then you know you old. You sitting there like... Hey, listen, you're about to come over here and get over there. You start thinking about your bills and all kind of shit. You sitting there driving, ain't no music playing. You sitting there, did I pay that light bill? They gonna cut that shit off. I hope that shit ain't off when I get home. That's when you know you get going. You know what I'm saying? That's why I like to party with people my age. Fuck that. I don't want to be in no young party and none of that shit. You know, because these kids nowadays, you don't know what's going on with them. You know, everybody doing pills and all this stupid shit. I'm the only one that's drunk. Everybody else high. You know, niggas is asking you all kind of dumb shit. Hey, bro. Where you, get, where you get them shoes from? Get out of my face, nigga. <laughs> you know, I like to hang out with people my age. That when, we, when we hear music, we can all sing that shit together. I like that. Because, you know, when you try to hang out at the young parties and you try to... Because a lot of us that's from the 1900s don't want to get old. So we try to fit in with the young folks. I'm going to tell you right now, fellas, ladies, y'all not fitting in. Because they know we not from the era. They know that. Oh, you see, you think because you in the club going like this. You think you fit in? No. You are the old nigga going like this. And you look even more dumb because they know you not the age. Because we do shit differently. You know what I'm saying? We wear our clothes differently. You know, we 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 dip when we hear a good song. You know, when you hear something, that shit come on, you be like, ooh, that's my oh, shit. These young people do not dip. So the moment you dip, you done gave away your age away. As soon as you hear a nice song and you go, oh, that's my shit, be like, look at that nigga, he's 46. Look at this old ass nigga right here. They know he's not part of their fucking generation. You know, my boy told me to come out one day. He was like, yo, come out, bro. It's going to be a nice little networking thing. You come out, you talk to some people, you know, make some opportunities. I said, all right, cool. I came out, it was a bunch of young guys. 24, 23, 26. I'm like, what is going on? So you know what? I played my corner. I stayed by the bar and I had my little drink and I was chilling. I'm drinking my little drink. This little young nigga walk over to me, yo, Pops, you got the time? Pops. How the fuck you gonna just walk over here and just call me Pops, bro? I'm not even bothering nobody. You gonna call way over here to call me Pops. Get the fuck out of here, bro. He was like, damn, hey, bro, you mad aggressive, my nigga. Like, I was just about to ask you what cologne you had on, bro. I said, nigga, I got on Tiger Bombs for men, nigga. Get the fuck away from me, bro. 
This is icy hot. But leave me alone, bro. <laughs> the fuck is going on here? You know when you old, man.